what's your dream, Kiara? So my dream is to work in women's health, and I actually will be doing that shortly after I pass boards um, within a residency program. So labor and delivery, pediatrics, and um, postpartum. And then further along after that, I would love to practice as a women's health nurse practitioner, kind of maybe in the hospital or in a gynecologist's office. For someone who's interested in nursing, you are talking about doing something that it sounds like there's another, there's more training, more schooling. So can you kind of just walk us through what that process is for someone who's interested in going to nursing, but then wants to be in a more specialized area? That was actually something when I was in high school, I had probably a gazillion questions for so many people about, you know, what route should I go? I really didn't understand the difference between an associate's degree in nursing versus a bachelor's degree in nursing. So ICC offers an associate's degree in nursing program. So you can go through and take like English and math and everything at the same time, or if not before, um, you take your two-year nursing program. And then you go on and you sit for NCLEX, which is, you know, Illinois state boards so that you can practice as a nurse. But if you go through a bachelor's program, you know, you have those four years, but then you also sit for that same, the same NCLEX, so nursing boards. So your degree will be different, but your title is still going to be registered nurse. But after you take your associate's degree in nursing, um, most hospitals in this area, they're called magnet hospitals. They want you to get your bachelor's within five years of signing on to work with them. Kind of makes the hospital look a little bit better if the majority of their staff has that higher level of education. So if you get your associate's degree in nursing, you know, you can come out from a community college sometimes debt-free because there are lots of scholarships and then work for a hospital that will pay for you to get your bachelor's online. So that route is kind of why I went that way because it would be cheaper than paying four years for Bradley and coming out (laughs) with a ton of debt, but then the same degree. So that's kind of the introductory. And then, you know, if you want to go further on, you can like pursue your master's. And I mean, in that avenue, I want to go for, you know, a nurse practitioner, but some people go to teach, you know, to be a clinical instructor. There's just so many different pathways within nursing that make it a very like versatile career. You'll never get bored. (laughs) 